Hey engineers, ever wondered how Lean Six Sigma actually fits into mechanical engineering? Today, I'm breaking down how mechanical engineers use Lean Six Sigma tools to solve real problems, boost efficiency, and drive results. As a mechanical engineer, your world revolves around systems, machines, processes, and designs. But what happens when those systems are inefficient, slow, or prone to errors? That's where Lean Six Sigma comes in. It gives you a structured way to identify waste, reduce defects, and make data-driven improvements. It's not just for managers, it's a hands-on engineering toolset. Let's get into how mechanical engineers use Lean Six Sigma on the job. 1. Reducing equipment downtime. Engineers use tools like Pareto charts and root cause analysis to determine why machines fail and then apply countermeasures to reduce downtime. 2. Improving production efficiency. Cycle time too long? Use value stream mapping to find bottlenecks and remove non-value added steps. 3. Quality improvement. Six Sigma helps reduce variation in product specs so every part meets tolerance. Tools like SPC charts and process capability analysis are key here. 4. Cost reduction projects. Whether cutting energy use, optimizing maintenance schedules, or reducing scrap, Lean Six Sigma helps engineers quantify the problem and track the savings. Design for Six Sigma. Mechanical engineers working in R&D use DFSS to build quality into the design phase, using tools like FMEA and QFD. Now let's review the tools mechanical engineers use most. These tools help you visualize problems, pinpoint causes, and implement solutions that actually stick. And you don't need to be a data scientist, just an engineer with a mindset for continuous improvement. Now, here's the bonus. Lean Six Sigma isn't just useful on the job, it makes you more valuable as a professional. Mechanical engineers with Lean Six Sigma skills are in high demand because you can improve processes, save money, and lead cross-functional teams. Want to move into leadership? This is how you start showing you're ready. Ready to get started? Here's what I'd recommend. 1. Start with the basics. Learn Lean, DMAC, and key tools. 2. Get certified. A yellow belt or green belt gives you a solid foundation. 3. Apply it at work. Start small. Reduce setup time, streamline inspection steps, or map a workflow. You don't need permission to start improving, just curiosity and consistency. Mechanical engineers are problem solvers by nature, and Lean Six Sigma just makes your problem solving more powerful. On behalf of the InfiniLean team, thank you for watching. If you found this helpful, drop a like, leave a comment about your experience with LSS, and subscribe for more practical engineering tips. See you soon.